Yo, get off my nuts. Oh, he f***ed up. Oh, man, look at that play. Oh. Wish they didn't make every god use every stat. They don't. <laughs> they don't okay so this is me being brutally honest and don't take this personally this is just you what you just said i hear over and over again so that's not how the stats work in this game um it's not how the stats were gonna work at any point so some gods can use both th both strength and int most gods use one most like thor is all strength uh, loki all strength like some gods do only use one of the stats some of them use both some of them only use int you have to read the god which allows for more unique building it makes it more confusing which i can see why that would be like a turn off for some people but it's not every god and you don't have to worry about it on every god like you can have your favorite god and just never have to worry about it oh my gosh fibby jibby holy fidgy widgy do god cookerino He's never had his stun blink like that, and he just his mind is blown right now. He's lost in the sauce. Hi get him, get him, get him. Hi Beat that ass. Beat that ass. Get day we ah! Yes! Okay, that's still OP. That's nerfed. Oh, he just got it. Oh, I know that was close. It was close. No. Oh. What's up, G Wizzle? Wizzly? Wizzle? Wizzly? Thank you for the eight months. Oh, shit. Y'all say less. Ah! He's coming for the booty. He's on my cheeks. Nah. Oh, wait. I got cheeky, buddy. Thoral is kind of super buggy. If cancel your back with your ult, yes, it will fuck around. It is. It, it's also kind of weak, to be honest. I feel like Thor's ult is is not like the timing on it's off, and it's weak. Thor does. You're right. I wouldn't say he's ass other than a CC, but compared to like Poseidon and Cupid, yeah, he's. He, he feels more like a... Like, he's good damage, but I feel like he's a super CC butt. With, like, fairly good damage. But he doesn't 100 to 0 with his full combo as early as he should. And I think they really relied on that passive thing from the ult. The, like, chain lightning, thunderstruck, whatever shit. And it's ass. I feel like it doesn't do anything. I think I've missed... Like, yeah, haha, we can miss Thor ults. I think I've missed most of my Thor ults, where... I do not miss my throwouts like that ever. What the fuck is that pathing, bro? He's here. I'm coming again. Come here. Uh. Uh. Oh, she's level five. I'm done to die. Yep. No, dude. They made her ult so much better and so much easier to land. Yeah, the, that Thunderstruck shit is also pro procs on your three. And it just doesn't do anything. I don't really know what they could have done with it to make it better other than like raw damage. But it's pretty... It's nice for level one clear. It makes you clear the side camps while hitting the mid one. <laughs> but then that's it. Which is pretty sad, to be honest. They could have done so much more. I think the talents or aspects, whatever they're calling them, have a lot of potential to make poopy gods or gods that just don't feel great or gods they ported over exactly and just make them better. Nice, dude. Wait, what the fuck? Oh shit. Oh baby, give me that crack of lagging, bitch. Hi all. Hi all. Morgan gonna be here. 
probably lose this. Never mind, she's not here. I think extending Susano's three should have a longer duration if it doesn't hit. Like a longer cooldown or? What? I couldn't teleport to that. I don't know exactly what you mean. I think Susano is one of the best junglers in the game. Oh, she's at one health. No ult. We need a wizard's 100. I think Susano is like a top three jungler. He's too good. His team fight and his, his raw damage output from Hydra's procs and auto tech cancel. He's too good. Not in like a, like, like, uh, not in a nerf way, but in, uh, if you're not counter picking him, it could be a problem way. Okay. You mean like the, the teleport duration is out longer. So like if you three on somebody or whatever, you, you can wait longer, you know, six seconds to teleport back instead of four or something like that. I think he's fine. Exactly. There he is to be honest. I don't think I'd nerf him, but I definitely wouldn't buff him. The only thing I would debate buffing is his fucking, um, his ult size. But at the same time, his ult is still very good. Like, it's too good in smite one, so I think it's fine. I wouldn't fuck with it. Does Thana one need a buff? No. Thana is really good right now. I think he's one of the better pub stomp junglers. I, I mean, you can run around and clap. You do, it, a lot of people are building wrong. And I think that's why... You see people complain about gods and their damage. You're just building wrong. What's up, Tatsumi? Thank you for the 19. I'm not playing Wizard 101. I'm pretty sure I told Shmeep I'd rather sell all my computers and never play video games again than play Wizard 101. The healing needs a buff on the one? No. I, think he's, I literally think Thanos, or Thanos is fine. He feels really strong because of movement. Smite 2 made Hercules easier to play ability wise than in Smite 1. So people that like just never felt right playing him, you know, you couldn't, couldn't get the combos down or whatever the fuck. It's so easy now. Yo, these creeps are gonna fucking be up. Movement speed items shouldn't be in the game, I don't think. I really think they should take them out. I also think this cooldown shit that they have in the game where every item has a million cooldown right from the rip, I think that needs to go. I think it was cool to make like casual players have more fun, but I think coming into a free-to-play version of the game, they gotta get rid of that shit. Not a fan of it for the longevity of the game. Yeah, they, they made they made Hercules more fluid. I guess is the way I would I would describe it. Like his abilities are just smooth, and I I have a problem with that. Where I played him and I'm like, this feels great, but at the same time, it's easy to fucking play the game. The skill gaps in the game are like non-existent. Like you have Smite One Gold players who are able to compete with like Masters players in Smite Two right now because of the simplicity of the game. The mechanics don't exist. Like, even Thor's hammer is easier to hit. I swear his two, I, I feel like his two is off, but I feel like, like, Thor's hammer is easier to hit, even though it's kind of slower. I feel like fucking, um, like, Poseidon, they made the one super easy to hit, right? Because you can get the wider, wider one. They did that with a lot of gods. Uh, Izanami's ability is easier to hit, even the ults. I'm, I'm ulting, right? I got you. Got him. Coming. You live, you live, you live. I'm body blocking. I'm body blocking, yes. Let's go. Holy shit, it's 14 to 3. Oh, damn. Poor guys. I didn't realize. I was just gaming on him. Games feel pub stomp, your 10 minutes surrenders. Eh, that's the lack of player base. That's not the game. My ult did not kill her? No. Thor's damage is shit, shit, bro. I'm telling you. Like, it's not, it's nowhere near as good as Smite 1. It's Smite 1 at level tw 10, 11, or 12. I think it's level 11 or 12, where your, your 1 and your 3 are max. I think it's 12. You 100 to 0 everybody in Smite 1. In Smite 2, you 100 to 0 like nobody. It's really weird. It's, and that's, 
that's with perfect play that's perfect auto attack canceling out of the ultimate you don't kill people a lot of the time it's my one you don't even need to be able to perfectly auto attack cancel to kill somebody it's like going from dark Souls one elden ring like the controls are just more fluent than smite one ub5 gives us a handicap yeah I, that's that makes sense i mean i played dark souls three i didn't play one and in three it was a little more clunky feeling than elden ring elden ring smooth and cake Yo, get on my nuts. Oh, he fucked up. Oh, man, look at that play. Oh, I'm sorry, but that was, that was kind of raw. They got fucked. They got fucked, Arena, boys. I'm sorry, pals. Little squishy sobek boy. Building damage. Smite 2 was unnecessary? Strong disagree. Smite 2 is definitely necessary. The timing was off. They should have had one more year of Smite 1 while they developed Smite 2. But it's definitely necessary. They're out of date, bro. Smite 1, they literally can't do the things they want to do. <laughs> like, it's not possible with the engine to do a lot of the stuff they want to do. So imagine you're building something, right? So, like, say you're, like, a house builder. You've built houses for 20 years using the exact same shit, and you have a million new ideas for your new houses, but the foundation you have to use, you just can't build on it. You're not. It's not possible to do all these ideas you have. That's essentially what they have, because these devs were not the devs that created the game. Some of them were around, but they weren't, like, the, the ones in charge. So imagine you come into something that's been built and you have all this new shit you want to do. You don't want to do what they've been doing. You, you want to create your fucking shit and you can't do it. So guess what? They put on a new engine. It allows them to do it. They, the CEO fucked up the timing because there's no way the devs decided, hey, we want to pump this out right now. I mean, I know for a fact, like even the esports shit, they did not want to, they, they, they were forced into this situation. So hundred fucking percent, they needed to. It was outdated like a motherfucker, bro. The code was also dog shit. They would never say it publicly, but their code from OG Smite was dog ass. A ma like, like these motherfuckers would change like Thor's hammer and fucking Cupid would break. <laughs> like, how does that make sense? I think he went left or right? Oh, he went right. Gadget bitch. Hacks of the last gank. I'm gonna be honest, I was talking to you guys. I don't even know what I did. I don't know who I killed. Uh no idea. That was like flow state, not paying attention. Autopilot. Just gaming, bro. I'm coming. Oh, they're running, bro. Unstoppable. McDub. Mm -mm. I know he hears me. Oh! <laughs> Double tap on him, bro. 520. That sucks. Oh, shit. I did an extra fit. What the fuck? Free beads. Yo! Oh, fuck! Help! 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 No! Uh, I did my best, boys. I apologize. Yeah, Haddix is missing his 400 viewers from botting. And he still probably only has five people talking in there. How fucking embarrassing, bro. I think he's been doing it for over a year. Why is Twitch stuttering on video, but audio is fine? I'm running a 4070. Is it do it on every browser? that you run have you tried like fucking the microsoft browser firefox chrome everything Your left tower is under attack. dude i am freezing i have to close this window my hands are frozen ready. 
you using opera like what are you using stuff like that whatever like twitch should not be fucked for you if your internet's not fucked use opera gx or well, rogue saying opera gx is fucked so try chrome try firefox what's up tito how you doing brother yeah try both of those first because if it's all of them then it's probably something fucking up that shouldn't be unless it's your internet if it's not then obviously it's opera Opera GX is fucked. I can't use it either. Just stream Twitch. <laughs> oh, there you go. Twitter tells you delete to delete some files. <laughs> okay, so it's literally fucked. Mm -hmm. It's like clearing out some caches and some other stuff. Oh, I fucked. Oh, I hit him. Nice. Well, there you go. I'm in casuals. I'm not playing ranked probably until we have like 50 gods, to be honest, or I mean, unless there's a big match making update. Cause like, I don't want to play the same shit I've been playing already. You know, I don't want to fucking not have Poseidon and Cupid in the game or something. Cause that's what's being banned. It's just snoozer. Thor does feel a little better. So the buffs to him while they were minor, they're definitely significant. I also haven't played in a couple days, so I need to get more matches on them to really have an opinion. I'm full right now, yeah. I don't know if somebody's gonna leave though. Who the fuck knows? What's up, Deucey? I've been enjoying Smite. Three nights, not three nights ago. Three, the last, like, like three nights worth of playing ago, so I didn't play the last two nights. Uh, or, I don't know what the fuck I played. But three nights ago when I was actually playing I hated I like it was the first night Thor beside him out was out and I was like this is boring and I thought about it the next day and it's because I went in having expectations and when I'm just focused on content and playing the gods and fucking around I've been having a lot of fun the last couple nights it's almost like sweating right now like the game's not ready for you to hard sweat like in situations hard sweat right but like overall go in hard sweating is kind of pointless right now oh shit oh fuck Where'd she go? Where'd she go? Where'd she go? Where'd she go? Oh, I found her. Hi what? I blinked! Nah, fuck that. I'm in. Ah! Ah! He's shook. He's shook. What? I missed. Oh, I missed out the... Oh, nice! My... Wait, what killed him? Uh, yeah, let's try to get out of here. They're scared. They're scared. We're good. We're good. Hi Mage Nem build. Mage Nem build can be fun if you get a lead. I feel like if you don't have a lead, it's dog. I ran that one of my first games and I hated it. Ran my other build. I think AA is just better right now. I mean, they did buff them, so maybe the buff makes a difference. Oh, oh, I can say after playing more Smite 2, fuck Susano. Oh, he's good. I don't think a lot of people understand when I say he's one of the best junglers. They just don't get why. But his damage output from level two on is insane. As long as you don't get super far behind. He's just pumping, dude. Pumping. And he's got a lot of annoying CC. Rank's not even easy even matches, though, dude. Like, one out of four matches is worth playing in ranks. His ability Cupid back? I think it's the only way I would play Cupid. I feel like AA Cupid is not better than any other of the AA Hunters. Poseidon's OP. That's why he's fun. He's doing like two times more damage. So some one of uh, my dude Woody who builds a website went into jungle practice and the one at max rank with the two proc was doing more damage than the ultimate. So uh, make that make sense. A fucking two minute cooldown doing less damage than a thir three second cooldown. Fuck me. Yeah, you bitch. Ah. Uh. Wait, good shield? How are they gonna shield? Oh, her heroism. Oh, fuck. Oh. Yo, what? Was that a. Wait, 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 wait. Wait, 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 wait. 
Does she attack speed debuff? Does Morgan have an attack speed debuff? Because I just didn't swing out of my A cancel. What the fuck was that? It was so slow. Am I trolling or did I get trolled? Because that's either some kind of bug or she has an attack speed debuff. Is Sam building A Poseidon? A Poseidon swings, dude. I think it's better than ability. Then it's not full AA. Like you go like three AA items or two. I forget the build, bro. It's either two or three. And then you're going like, you know, rod and normal fucking items. You got DR stunned, it looked like. I, I got stunned? I thought it was in my swing though. No, I don't think she stunned me. Because these are auto attacks. She didn't stun me. So I don't know what the fuck that was. What's up, Adam? What happened to the screen? What do you mean? What the fuck? What the fuck? Why the fuck did he just he walk in there and kill me? He watched you walk into that bush. What the fuck? Where was he? He was in, coming from the lane. What a <laughs> nerd, dude. Something. Little turd muncher. I'm reading chat, bro. I'm just running around. I know. I was trying to say something when my mic was beat. I'm like, the side saw you. <laughs> Sweaty bitch. It was the browser. There you go. Yeah, I'm wondering if Morgan's fucking auto attack passive has an attack speed slow because that's what it felt like. I'd have to check. All right, boys, lock in. We're only up 14k. It's a close one. Poseidon pumps damage, dude. Fuck it, ridiculous. This is all over 950. What the hell? Does she have an active or a defense item? Oh, she is defense. But she doesn't have anti-attack speed. Oh no, that's that's not right. That's not her build, I don't think, right? Or is it? Because if that's her build, that's disgusting. Yo, I need a fucking beads, boys. Sheesh. Oh, she died. That shit, yeah, buddy. Uh, all that to run after me. Sick. Oh, she has Pharaohs? Well, she's dead right now, so I don't even know. Bro, if she had Pharaohs after fighting and using on me, she's a dick. That's some fucked up shit. Nice, team. Lock the fuck in. Okay. Yeah, they definitely made Thor's wall too thick. I don't know what's up with that. Too much, too much going on there. What's up, K-Mick? I'm good, man. I've been sick uh, the last three days, and today it felt the worst. You sick too? Yeah, I have a, I'm pretty sure I have a sinus infection. I'm just hoping none of the kids get sick and Sammy doesn't get sick. I think I got it from Lincoln. Are you a nerd playing do on mid? Yeah. Yeah, you are actually. That's some cringe shit. That's top tier cringe shit. Give me some shields, baby. You know what they should do? The Thunderstruck passive shit on Thor should not have a timer. It should have an auto attack amount on it. You should be able to stack them up. 
Oh, 100 to 0 there. Yo, this dude is tanky as fuck. All that just to get clapped, huh? Oh shit! Oh shit! Yeah, with just five items and no beads. The thing is, besides us one health item, I don't. I'm pretty sure I don't hundred to zero. That's what's weird about it. Oh. Thor is weaker. It definitely is weaker. Passive every time it's active should play Thunderstruck by... No, it shouldn't, Sweep. This is why you don't work at high res. Why not? Because I don't need to be hearing that shit while I run around the map. That's why. My team carried me. 